Hello everyone, my name is Ifa Labi and welcome to another video. So today's video is an ode to my childhood, probably my adolescence, teenage years. And today's video is all about meat pies. Okay, when I was younger, we used to have the chef that used to do meat pies. And when he set us to do the meat pie, oh boy, it was just it was perfection. Okay, he was such a great chef. So today's video is an ode to two things. One, my adolescence. And two, Ghanaian dessert like what is a Ghanaian party without meat pie how can you go to an engagement without getting a meat pie outdoor wedding you just have to have meat pie so that's what that's what this video is about it's about meat pie that's what you're going to do i'll see you on the other side so start off with this meat pie you're going to season the meat so to do that you need oil in a pan then add diced onions to it add two cloves of garlic to it mix that around add a half pound of meat so you mix that around in the frying pan mix 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 then you add in salt a tablespoon of oregano a tablespoon of thyme a tablespoon of black pepper and then i added my secret ingredients which was chili pepper and then add garlic powder ginger powder basically season this how you want your meat to taste like that's basically it but for me this was the seasoning i used and then i mixed it all together so i realized that i used uh, quite a lot of onions for the meat i selected so it let us simmer come back to it mix it simmer come back to it and then it's done moving on to our pastry crust two pounds of soft flour, two tablespoons of baking powder. So mix that all together, add in a dash of black pepper, mix, 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 and then add in a one pound ma cold margarine. I saw somewhere that when you make your margarine or your butter cold, it makes the crust more flaky. So that's what I did. I put the margarine in the fridge for like 30 minutes before I started it, and then added it to the flour mixture. Then so that you're going to this is the rubbing in method for pastries so just rub it in between your fingertips make sure that it looks like fine sand like sand you find by the sea mix it all together till it resembles a crumbly mess and that's my mom's hand mixing in the cold water make sure the water is very very cold just about three tablespoons of cold water if you're worried about how it looks don't worry don't add more water to it divide your dough into four Take one and put it onto a well floured surface. Use a rolling pin to roll it out. Now I am back again with my atrocious rolling skills. But not to worry, just roll it out and then use for for us at home we used a burger cutter to do take it out, roll again, cut it, take it out, roll again till you finish rolling and cutting out all the dough. Cold water, use your fingertips and add in your prepared meat mixture be very gentle with this so you don't break the crust like i did use a fork or anything you want for a design to just press it all together final thing to do is the egg wash put this in the oven for 25 minutes voila look at this lovely lovely piece of dough meat pie we are back i have my plate of warm meat pie and to eat this meat pie i had to get a drink so this is a cold sprite but ideally, for me, if I'm eating meat pie, I like it with either apple juice or pineapple juice. Those two things go really well with meat pie. Or fan yogurt, the classic. Let's open this and see how the inside looks like. For me, I like the crust more than the insides of a meat pie. Just because most of the time when you buy meat pie, the insides, there are very strange things inside. So I really like the crust. So I want to know, are you more of a crust person? Or an inside filling person. Let's try it. So this part is really great, just because I did the filling and I, I spiced it the way I like it. So I don't. I'm not going to complain about that because I did it. But this is really great. It reminds me of outside, you know. So this is a great recipe to have or to do when there are people around, when you have visitors, you know. I'm done with this meat pie video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Leave me your comments on what recipe you'd want to see me try next. And stay safe out there and I'll see you on my next video.